after we have reviewed all of our data in our worksheet and made sure everything is fine, we can adjust some of the views before we generate any reports. The box icon will allow you to view your diagram in 3D view and also zoom to fit. Zoom to fit is if you knew you drew something on this diagram but can't seem to find it. If you zoom to fit, the system will center your diagram so that it fits within your screen. Under the wrench icon, we can hide or show different information shown on our diagram. For example, if we want to disable the product legend, because we don't want to preview the products that we've applied, we can uncheck product legend. Unchecking dimensions will hide the dimensions on the diagram, and so forth. Keep in mind the way the diagram shows on your screen now is the same way it will appear on any reports. Now from the box with the arrow up, you can manage your project in several different ways. Use share project file if you want to send this diagram to another user so that they can make changes to it. The user must have measure score installed on an iPad or iPhone. You can use save to other app if you want to save this project file to another app such as Google Drive or Dropbox if you have it installed on your iPad. Print Report will allow you to generate a report in PDF format. Check or uncheck the different properties that you want to show, such as a diagram, cut sheet, or estimate summary. Under the Advanced menu, you can change your username as it appears on your report and adjust different factors, such as the way it's laid out or if you want to display or hide the cut sheet. Select Done, and the system will generate a PDF. From this preview, you can share the report via email, print it if you have a printer paired to your iPad, or save this PDF to another app such as Dropbox or Google Drive. Print templates is more like an invoice. You also have a preview of your cut sheet and diagram, and the final sheet is more like an invoice. The settings from this screen allow you to capture a customer signature per their approval of scene placement or product application. You can also adjust different factors such as your company name and add an image of your logo to include on the invoice. The invoice is also in PDF format and can be shared via email, print it if you have the printer paired to your iPad, or save it to another app such as Google Drive or Dropbox. Keep in mind, if you capture a customer signature, you want to save a copy of the preview because once you select Done, the signature will not be saved. Don't forget to sync your diagram from the home screen. We suggest you sync if you have internet connection after each diagram, if possible.